Um, I think we're um, in the beginning we had some problems in because um, they were playing with one holding and three midfielders uh, just behind our our midfield line. So they had always on the opposite side someone free. Uh, it caused us problems in the beginning. Then uh, we tried to solve that after 20-25 minutes. But we already conceded. Um, so you're running again behind uh, a score. Um, second half we tried to, to change a bit. Uh, more offensive uh, with an extra midfielder also an extra striker in the end. Uh, then we could make more tempo on the ball. We could create a bit more because the first half, I don't think we had uh, chances. Um, so in the end, we fought for it, but we, didn't, we could not come back in the score today. Uh, so we lost. I saw, uh, even me, uh, many disappointed uh, faces, what is normal when you lose. Um, Okay, when you make uh, 10 or 11 games in a row, the first loss comes closer. But that doesn't mean it had to be today. Uh, I think in the end, um, maybe with more uh, drive in the first half and maybe a better, faster solution to, to close their midfield, um, we could have done better today. Stories outside, uh, this one, this one. So Mzamiru, he picked up an injury uh, 4th of January, he's out already for a month and I think it will still be a few weeks. Then we have Miraji who came back from national team with his injury. He retried in the beginning of January but it will also take uh, another 3-4 maybe more weeks. Um, Kanda, he also picked up an injury against Yanga on 4th of January. Uh, he's a bit better. He started light training uh, the last two days. Then we have Erasto Nioni who, was, uh, who picked up an injury two games ago. I think we will have him back within 10 days if we give him some time or a bit more days. And then we have sick people. Kapombe, uh, already 7 to 10 days together with Rashid Juma, they have tonsillitis, yes, tonsillitis. Yeah. So they were on medication for a, a long period and we hope to get them back uh, as soon as possible with the team. I think in the beginning we, we could not create many chances. Uh, in the end it was better. Uh, we uh, gave up one, one midfielder or sitting midfielder for an offensive one. And we brought also an extra, an extra striker, so we could push more forward. Uh, maybe we had more solutions to play forward, what makes it easier for defenders to play. Um, yes, maybe we miss, uh, or we missed from the start a midfielder who could make the distance between, or be the link between both defense and offensive part. No. Uh, every team has uh, injured players or a suspended player, so you always miss players. Uh, we don't going to use this as an excuse today, uh, not even for the past or the future that will come. Every team has to suffer such uh, things. And those who are in the squad, they are in Simba for, to play football, to play on, the, on this level, so everyone should be ready to, to play every game or any game. Yes, if you see the, the, the first games until the first four or five weeks, we always created a lot of chances. Uh, there was a lot of movement uh, from from after we came back from one side. I think yes, the, uh, we find less solutions forward. Uh, teams are also blocking our midfield uh, better than the first games. Um, a problem. If you're not creative, there is somewhere something. Uh, it can be the mind, it can be not enough solutions up front, it can be drive, it can, can be money things. We, we had good talks the past two days and I had a good feeling for today. 
uh, unfortunately the result is not following the, the feeling we had on training yesterday and two days ago. If you change uh, last minute the venue uh, and you train on grass during a long period, uh, then it's difficult to go to artificial, but it's not only our problem. I think the, the opponent had to face the same issue. So we don't have to hide about after or behind these things. Uh, I think today you have to look to yourself and maybe the past couple of games you have to already look to yourself. You don't have to find excuses uh, for such things. On the new guys, um, difficult to say. Um, on training they gave a good impression. I think today I have a mixed feeling about both. Um, Luis was for sure better than Kichuya. Um, but you cannot judge them in one, in one game. Uh, give them some time, they're new. Uh, they're training with us, yes, uh, but it was their first game. Uh, let's see what's uh, coming the next uh, couple of weeks. A setback, you can take it as two, in two ways. Uh, you can go down with your head and you stay down and you get demo demotivated. Or you take it the way that you learn things and you, you stand up and you keep your head up again to, to step out next game to win it again. So that's two ways. Let's see who will pick the right way and react in a good way.